Hi, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how I made my graphite powder kit and how you can make one for yourself to save time when shading a background in your drawings. So let's get started. Okay, so the three main items you need is a pack of 20 gram cosmetic containers, a fine grit sandpaper and a wordless graphite pencil set. The optional items are a sticker print, scissor or craft knife and an extra container for mixing. So head over to your local art store and get these wordless graphite pencil sets. You can also get them from Amazon or any online art store as well. I will find and add the links in the description for you. And on your way back home, stop by a local hardware or paint store and get a fine grit sandpaper anywhere between 200 to 1000 grit. And you can easily get these cosmetic containers from Amazon, eBay, AliExpress or any online marketplace. Or just use any empty containers or something like that if you don't have budget for cosmetic container set. Okay, so all you need to do now is rub the graphite sticks on the sandpaper until you get a decent amount of powder from it. And then transfer the powder to a container. You can use a hard bristle brush to extract the powder which sticks to the sandpaper. You can use a paper or a plastic sheet to avoid making any mess during this process. The woodless graphites usually come in even number grades. So if you want to make the odd numbers as well, you can just thoroughly mix a darker and a lighter graphite powder equally to get a medium grade graphite powder. You can use a 12 piece container set for this purpose. And when you're done with the filling process, just print out your stickers, cut them into size and then paste them on the containers. And that's it. Now you can use these graphite powders to easily shade any background in your future drawings. It takes so much time and efforts to create these tutorials for you. So please leave a like if you enjoyed this one. It helps me a lot as a creator. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.